starting position there, and he was in a position to close down the space quickly. Tried to tackle here, and he's done that. Attacking well here. Doing well to keep the ball. The shot's on! Oh, it could have been the go-ahead goal. Oh, what a chance to get the noses in front here. Maybe you won't get too many better. You feel here, Alan, that the home team would take a draw and the away fans, they expect their side to come here and win and uh, at the moment, obviously, it's level. Uh, they feel that it's time wasting going on. Yeah, well, I think that he might be through. Shot on, and that is the goal that puts them in front. Well, one team is very happy here, and one team is very frustrated. And yet, you wouldn't have expected that kind of gap between these two. They deservedly lead. Well, they've knocked the ball about well, Martin, and uh, knocked it about with confidence. And as you say, they're two evenly matched sides, so that's been a big achievement for them. Good forward play from them. It's an exhibition here with such great passing. Got to be. Good try. Tomiyama. Good challenge. On the attack here. Nicely played through ball. He's got his shot off now. Goal. They lead by two now. Took the chance nicely. And that really has given them much more of a basis for the rest of this match. For goalkeepers, heroes or zeros, it's a zero against his name here. Well, he left his post, he's outside the six-yard box, and it was a poor decision from him. The official has indicated three more minutes. Three minutes. Keeps it going. Now he's a chance from winning the ball. And shoots! Well, he's failed to keep his shot down. Now Tommy Yama. It's a good place to win the ball here. Into the attacking third. Here comes the cross. Well, that's half time, and 3-1 is the score at the break. Two sides of this particular story, the home side. Oh, the attacker's done well, beating his man. To put them in front. With uh, a goal to his name, the midfield player is now coming off. Yeah, he's one of those key midfielders, probably one of the first on the manager's team sheet. Done himself no harm here.
and Kosin. Not rushing it here, moving from one side to the other. And the cross coming in, and heads it towards goal. Flag up for offside, it's not going to count. Well, really good organisation from the defence, and it was offside looking at it. And in he goes with the tackle. Well, he's got the ball there in the defensive zone by reading the play very well. And the referee says, free kick. Well, it's time for a change now up front. And the one goal that he scored isn't going to spare him getting substituted here. No, he's played his part, but that time in the match now where his manager, I think, wants a, an injection of pace just to try and stretch those defenders. I think that's a good performance, isn't it, Alan, from him in the first half? I would be happy with that first 45 minutes. It was a good goal from him, good overall performance, actually. They've linked up well. The shot's on! What a fine save! That's a corner. <laughs> Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation he has been pressed there to running the ball out of play Well, they're not playing very much like a team. They don't seem to be helping each other as much. That's a gift for them. It's an own goal. It's his responsibility. It's definitely an own goal. It is. You'd like to try and defend him, but he just didn't make up his mind quickly enough there. Bad enough to be behind now, but to do it with an own goal is particularly annoying for the team and the player in question. And they've cut it out. Deli Alley working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal. He's awarded the free kick. The uh, attack has fizzled out here. Goal kick. What an organiser of this team. He's in great form. He's got this ability, hasn't he, just to pull away from his marker, get into space on the half turn, and that was a wonderful assist. And he's got the ball away from him with the tackle. Now Tommy Yama. Maybe this team need the psychologist to get to work on uh, one player in particular who's, I don't know, he just doesn't seem to be happy at work. No, he sticks out like a sore thumb, really, and uh, whether he's mates with his teammates off the pitch, I don't know, but on it... Oh, What a lovely death finish that was. They are playing well. Their superiority 
increased really with this goal. Well, you can only see more goals coming their way, the way they played. 5 1 the score, and we go. 20 minutes of the 90 still to play. Attacking well here. And it will go into the. Middle now. Manchester City 3, West Bromwich Albion 1. So what do those results mean to the league table? At the top of the table remain Arsenal with 76 points. In second, Chelsea with 73 points, with a game in hand on the team above. In third, Tottenham Hotspur with 64 points. In fourth, Manchester City with 58 points. In fifth, Crystal Palace with 52 points, with a game in hand on the team above. Hi there, Alan Smith. Hi there to everybody from both of us, and welcome to this big match today. Match here today, Middlesbrough against Manchester City. Well, for a long time, Manchester City were a lovely club to visit, particularly if you were playing against them. But since the money's come in from Abu Dhabi, they are up there and expected to win honours, aren't they? Season in, season out now. Well, they are. And they haven't disappointed on that front in terms of the league title and some domestic trophies. Still trying to uh, go the extra mile in Europe, but uh, they are a force to be reckoned with these days. Manchester City started this first half. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. And this is the 11 that will take the field for Middlesbrough. Victor Valdez starts in goal. Gaston Ramirez starts, looking to recover his form. Alvaro Negredo is the lone striker today. Manchester City's lineup today. David De Gea starts in goal. Juan Mata starts. A player struggling for four. In attack, Zlatan Ibrahimovic plays up front with Neymar. Oh, the attack has done well, beating his man. Papa! Great stop. Manchester City get a corner.
Manchester United 2, Swansea City 0. Middlesbrough 3, Manchester City 0. So what do those results mean to the league table? At the top of the table remain Arsenal with 77 points. In second, Chelsea with 76 points, with a game in hand on the team above. In third, Tottenham Hotspur with 65 points. In fourth, Manchester City with 58 points. In fifth, Crystal Palace with 56 points. In sixth, rising up the table are Manchester United with 54 points. In seventh, climbing the table are Middlesbrough with 52 points. In eighth and falling are Stoke City with 51 points. Bottom of the table, Sunderland.